What's up YouTube? Welcome to another video. I'm out here in Palm Springs this morning doing a little ride. I'm gonna head out north from the city and uh, loop around, drop down Thousand Palms. So, should be a good day. It's early enough, it's not too warm. Let's go get it. So it hasn't been windy at all until just now. I uh, just started the ride and it was like super calm. And then all of a sudden I turn a corner and it's like gale force winds. So it must have something to do with like the canyons and the shape of the mountains and stuff. But there's definitely like wind roots, you know, where the wind is just slicing through and it's blustery out here, but kind of cool how that works. Like literally half a mile back that way, it's calm. And then you get over here and the wind's ripping at like 20 miles an hour. Pretty cool. Oh no. Flashbacks. Nope. <laughs> uh. So I didn't realize the pavement ends right here. I was trying to do, uh, take Gene Autry to straight north across the, uh, whatever this freeway is right here, and then drop down Thousand Palms. But Gene Autry, it was closed, so I had to cut west to pick up Indian Creek or something like that. And then there was construction on the other side of the freeway on the Indian Creek Road. And so I just tried to go down this other road. Now it's turning it into sandy gravel. And I'm getting really bad flashbacks to uh, my time in the desert. I'm not even gonna do it. I'm not even gonna bother. I'm gonna go back to the pavement because desert riding is fun on the pavement. There's a ripping uh, headwind this way, so just gotta backtrack just a little bit. We get out of this stupid gravel, stay on the pavement, deal with the construction zone, and get back to ride. A few moments later. This is why I was trying to find that alternate route. We got traffic coming by on this road right here doing probably 45, 50. No shoulder, it's all sandy. So I'm having to time my pavement sections. I'm turning right, right here at the stop sign so I can see it from here. I'm just timing out the uh, traffic here. I'm trying to stay safe on these roads, man. Construction does not make it easy, but here's my window. As you can see, not ideal. This little side street that I ducked into actually, I think, connects down there up to the main road. So I'm gonna take another detour, <laughs> a safer one. All right, got sorted here, figured out the construction zone, back on the route that I wanted to be on. I got a rip in uh, tailwind here. I'm doing 24 miles an hour, I'm not even trying. It's the second time that's happened to me, to me out in the desert, which is pretty awesome. <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous about having to deal with it on the way back, but hopefully it won't be too bad. 
feels good though. It is gorgeous riding out here in the, uh, in the desert. I love it. Yesterday was 106 in the middle of the day. It's not supposed to get that high today, but we'll be home before it gets uh, too nasty. lack of bike lanes in this city. I have no idea why. I mean, I'm sure the locals all know where they're at. You know, I just don't ride enough out here to know exactly where they are, but I'm on one of the roads that actually has a bike lane, which is nice. So, almost home. Well, almost to the hotel. Donut stop is next. <laughs> all right, got the goods. No, these are not all for me. Brought some for the family, so I'm really close to the uh, the hotel. I'm gonna wrap up this ride. Call it a day. So there's this bridge, the Gene Autry Bridge. And it says, pedestrians, bicycles, motor driven, cycles, prohibit, wait, pedestrians, bicycles, yeah, yeah. For some reason, I mean, there's a great big shoulder on it, but they don't want you to cross it. But uh, I gotta go across the little, there's a the little, path that you have to take since you can't ride across it but I don't want to get caught or get yelled at so we'll follow the rules. All right we made it safe with the donuts. It's a little bit of a hole in the bag almost a catastrophic loss but pulled it out pulled out the save. So uh, it's almost 10, 10 a.m. now it's starting to get pretty warm. But uh, great ride. I had a lot of fun despite the detours and the lack of shoulders. But overall, it was a safe ride. And uh, any ride that you finish safe is, is a successful ride. So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.